Governor Godwin Obaseki noted that the commercial production hub will serve as a location for design and production of machines so as to create opportunities for students to work with those in the industry and translate what they have learned to the real world. Governor Obaseki stated that the state government is in talks with foreign partners for exchange program which will make provision for experts to train teachers on technical subjects. We've made a lot of progress, um, significant amount of progress. We're more than 50% of where we expect to be. In fact, I'll say more than 60% of where we expect to be. As you can see, we have now successfully finished building two new blocks uh, with workshops that will accommodate about 800 students. We now need to move into the old um, blocks, the old premises, and then begin to strip them and rebuild them and make them more modern. We also are rebuilding the workshops, as you can see, the electrical mechanical workshops, the carpentry workshops. What we are looking at is also to create another production hub in this premises, a commercial production hub, just like you have in Sapele Road. He said the state government is engaging foreign partners to provide technical support and assistance to accelerate the training of teachers. The governor explained that the state government was restructuring the teachers' training program, which will allow the state to have one college of education with three campuses with specialties in various aspects of teaching. He said the campus in Abudu will focus on training teachers for early basic education and children with special needs. The college at Igwebe campus will focus on training teachers on secondary schools and technical subjects, while the Afuze campus will focus on training teachers on physical, sporting education, and specialized program, he noted. Governor Baseki said the state government is working with several bodies, especially countries in the European Union, in executing projects of this nature and to help deal with human trafficking and curtail irregular migration. Clearly, we need many, many more teachers who can teach technical subjects. Uh, we need to train them. It will take a while uh, to get them to power. But in the meantime, we're considering options, uh, we're talking to foreign governments, uh, we're trying to get technical support, technical assistance to see how we can bring in um, people who already have done these things in other countries to accelerate the training for our teachers. Uh, don't forget also that we are restructuring our whole teacher training program. Team leads Government Science and Technical College Bini Rehabilitation Program, Gilles Omeze, expressed delight that the 2019-2020 academic session for students of the school commenced on Monday, September 16, 2019, adding that the National Board for Technical Education is pleased with the project. Patience, Osaugiwa reporting.